The subject of this video is Microsoft's to-do app for the desktop. Grab your coffee and let's get started. So to obtain the to-do app, go to the app store, go to search, type in to-do, and download Microsoft to-do. Next, let's, let's open up to-do, go to my day, and click on add a task. Use any name you like, my new task. There's the task. Let's click on the task and look at the properties of the task. So you can add steps, which is like a checklist. This could be handy for adding the specifics of the task, proceduralizing, systemizing. You can add it to my day, which is like your dashboard for the day of all your tasks. You can add a reminder, like remind me, and you can set a date and time. You can add a due date, and you can set up repeat, and you can also add a file, and you can add notes. Let's create a task list. In the lower left, click on New List. Enter a name for your new list. Now let's create a task within that list. New List. This is a drag and drop function I'll show you while we're here. You can drag and drop one of your tasks to a list. So let's edit a task. Select one of your tasks. The properties pane will appear to the right. And let's look at step. You can delete the step by clicking on the ellipses, select and delete. You can add the task to your My Day dashboard. You could update a reminder. You could update or set the due date. You could set repeat or reoccurrence. You could set it for every day or once a week. You can add a file. So for example, if there was a task to review a document, you could attach the document here and then share it. We'll get into sharing later, assigning. You can update the text. I suck at typing when I'm presenting. I don't know what it is. Okay, there we go. Updated. I'm just going to delete that and retype it. And we're done. Let's have a look at themes. In the upper right, click on the ellipses. Click on Change Theme. And a palette will appear with solid colors, pictures, so you can experiment with these different colors. I haven't found a way to upload a theme. You can uh, adjust the theme to match your Windows desktop as best you can. Let's have a look at assign or share. You want to share a task and assign it to someone. Click on the icon. Click on invite. Select email. Enter the person's email address. Make a quick note. and then click Send. Simple as that. To stop sharing, click Stop Sharing. Next is Planned Tasks. Assigned is assigned to me. Those are tasks from a Teams uh, channel. And Planned. These are all the planned tasks that you have, and you can slice and dice and view based on the tabs at the top. This is a great way to look at your day, your week, your months. Now, finally, let's take a look at my day. This is where I work. 
mostly. This and the planner view. Here I can favorite or prioritize the tasks. I can drag and drop them to shuffle them around. I can add tasks. I can mark them as completed. Um, this helps me prioritize. I usually go by A being it must be done today or B it needs to be done tomorrow or the day after. And as I work through my day, I juggle the tasks, I drag and drop and update the properties as need be. So once you integrate the to-do app into your workday, you'll find that you'll not drop as many tasks and you'll have a clearer view of your day and your week and your month ahead. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please click like and subscribe. Thanks.